For today's rest ritual, I'll be continuing to guide you through Mantak Chia's healing sounds, a Taoist practice that uses sounds to purge out energy that's no longer serving you and colors to tonify and bring in the energy you want. The healing sounds are a great practice to do before bed because it helps you purge out the stuck, stale, stagnant energy of the day so that you can get a better night's sleep so you can rise ready to go the next day. Today, I'll be focusing on the liver. In Chinese medicine and Qigong, negative emotions associated with the liver are anger and frustration. Positive emotions that are said to be stored in the liver are creativity and kindness and generosity. It's hard to be creative and kind when we're feeling angry and frustrated. So we're going to purge out these negative emotions so we have more room for that abundant good energy that we want more of. The sound that we use to purge out the negative emotions of the liver is an SHHH, like a shh when you're trying to get something to be more quiet. So we'll use the shh to purge out anger and frustration, and then we'll tonify with a color. As we're doing this practice, I invite you to keep your eyes open as you're purging. And if you like, you can close your eyes as you're tonifying. So we keep the eyes open as we're sending energy out and we're closing the eyes as we're trying to seal energy in. As always, we'll start this practice with a deep breath in through the nose and you're going to fill up your belly, your ribs, and your chest. And then as you exhale, you're going to want to fully expel the air from your lungs and make that sound until all of that air is out. Let's do this together. Go ahead and inhale in. And as you exhale, make the sound. And we'll do that again. Inhaling in through the nose, filling up the belly, ribs and chest. And as you exhale, release anger, release frustration. And if you like, you can close the eyes. And this time we're going to imagine a spring green energy filling up your liver. It's like sunlight through the leaves of a tree. And if you want to know where your liver is, it's on the right side of your body underneath your rib cage. Filling up with that spring green sunlight through leaves light. And we'll do it again. Inhaling in through the nose. Exhaling out through the mouth. Again, in through the nose, filling up belly, ribs and chest. Exhaling out anger and frustration. Closing the eyes. Tonifying the liver with creativity, generosity, and kindness. And we'll do it all together one more time, taking a deep breath. All together, inhale. Exhaling together, out through the mouth. Last time, all together, inhale. Full breath in, full breath out through the mouth. Closing your eyes, filling up with green light, spring green light, filling your liver with creativity and kindness and generosity.
Again, this is a great practice to do before bed. You can do it on the edge of your bed. You can do it laying down. You can do this one time, three times, as many times as you want. You may notice yourself yawning. You may even notice yourself burping as you do this practice because we're clearing stuck, stagnant energy. And as we get the chi, the life force energy to start moving, things start to leave your body. And so you may notice that you start yawning as you start feeling more rested and relaxed. You may start burping as you're releasing things that were stuck in your body. All of this is completely to be expected. And if you're not experiencing any of those things, that's fine too. Again, these practices are most helpful when we can ritualize them, when we can do them continuously, whatever that means for you, if it's once a week or it's once a day, just coming up with something that you know you can stick to. And so that might be Again, one sound, that might be a lot of sounds. There's no wrong or right way to do this. As the Taoists say, there's your way, there's my way, and there's the way, and we can ebb and flow with that as much as we need to. Enjoy your ritual.